This is my ABI on City Hall, the place to get the latest news and updates straight from the City of Abilene. I'm Mari Cockrell, Communications Director for the City of Abilene. Get ready for some new street work in South Abilene. Bonkey Brothers has been contracted to resurface Southwest Drive from Clack down to Sharon Drive, so the length of roadway from Chick-fil-A just beyond Ashley Furniture. Work will be done in the overnight hours to minimize traffic concerns and will take about a month or so beginning the overnight of July 25th. If you have any questions, or concerns, call the city's engineering services at 325 676 6281. Abilene Taylor County Public Health District has moved its COVID vaccine clinics to the TSTC building on East Highway 80. The health district will be there Tuesdays and Thursdays from 830 to 4 p.m. Anyone 12 and up is eligible to be vaccinated and you can still go to abilenetx.gov slash vaccine schedule to set up an appointment. And also don't forget to check out the COVID-19 information dashboard at the health district's website. It is updated daily with the county's COVID-19 infection information. You may have heard this is a very busy time for our animal services with lots of animals available for adoption at the Abilene Animal Shelter. So always you can visit abilenetx.gov slash animal services to see available animals and learn more about the programs and fees available there at the shelter. Registration is now open for Parks and Recreation's after school program. The cost is just $15 per person per week, and that fee is waived for kids on the free or reduced lunch program. Also open at Parks and Rec, uh, sign up for this fall's Youth Flag Football League. You can find all of that and more at myabilineparksandrec.com. Budget season is upon us. City staff will be presenting the revised 2020-21 and proposed 21-22 fiscal year budget to City Council the week of July 26th. You can catch the budget workshop online or on Suddenlink Cable Channel 2. Uh, you'll also want to note that the second council meeting for the month of July has been moved from July 22nd to July 29th. You can find notices and agendas for all meetings at abilenetx.gov. You just click under the government tab there at the top. And finally, a big congratulations to Abilene Police Department's 58th graduating class. Seven cadets will graduate July 22nd, and after 1,000 hours of training over a 29-week period, they will each be sworn in as licensed peace officers. The department will also be graduating two telecommunicators who will become APD dispatchers after weeks of intensive training there as well. Congrats again, and thank you all for your service.